And the goal this next month too, is to take everything that I don't need and, and sell it, get rid of it. Like get it out of like the inventory for the year. So that way it's just less stuff, less clutter that I have to worry about. It is that time of the year. This is a week that I get, uh, I get very motivated around, I get pumped for, but I do not look forward to because of the work that is gonna be involved this week. Some of you may remember from last year, when I did like uh, a yearly clean out, like a, just a, like a reset. I built my stream PC and my gaming PC, and then we made like the 2021 setup. I took like a big breather away from like gaming and streaming and like this, this room to slowly build everything up and get everything out of here and out of my inventory that I don't need. So that way we could just, you know, sell it and, and declutter. It is that time of the year again. And this year we have more stuff and I have more things to organize and like it seems to be a yearly trend. Something that's just like, you know, it's a blessing and a curse to do this stuff. Obviously for those watching the video, it's like, you know, the grass is always greener. On your guys' side, it's just like last year when I did this, everybody's like, yeah, just send me all the gear. Yeah, well, it's not that easy. I, I worked really hard for my stuff so you know I'm gonna I'm gonna declutter my way but either way it's gonna be a very busy week lucky enough for you all I know you guys are all interested in set up stuff so it should be a, it should be a good week of productive videos that you guys are into today unfortunately is teardown day and teardown day is always like the easiest to do like it, it, all I got to do is literally take pretty much everything out of this room and, and organize it with the exception of like this setup here. I'm really pleased with my creative area. As far as the desk, the monitors, everything here, I love, I'm even gonna unplug everything so that way I can organize cables. I can, I can do some different, like some of the cable management that I've had throughout this year. It's like kind of come undone. But for the most part, this is staying. Uh, everything else, is is going for the time being and then i have to rebuild two computers and i'm also wondering if maybe i should just go ahead and like rebuild them and reformat them to be windows 11 as well by the way i'm curious how many of you guys do like a yearly reformat of your computers you're supposed to by the way just a heads up like every x amount of months like you should refresh and organize everything so that way like you know, newer drives can come in and, and your PC and laptop and whatever device you have can run freshly. I'm just kind of curious in the comments down below, how many people though have probably never done that? <laughs> So typically my first part of the teardown process, if I've never showed you guys this before, is take away the bulk of the stuff first. So like getting rid of the camera, the monitor, like the mouse keyboard, the, the actual like core to the electronics itself. And then I take down stands and then I actually leave cables for last. So now I have the tabletop out of the way and I have this mess of cables and I know like in the now it looks it looks really bad, but it's so much easier to go through all that stuff and, and match like, you know, the power supply with the computer and the monitor and the HDMI cables and just wrap everything up and put them where they need to be versus trying to keep everything up and, and take the cable with each device as I unplug everything. So there's a little tip, if you guys are ever breaking down a setup, I'd highly suggest just detach all your cables first and go through that later. It just makes eliminating objects to work around so much easier. All right, see, just like that, like I'm dead serious when I say five minutes later, all the cables are organized, they're with all their devices now, and like I have, I have no mess within five minutes. So for example, this setup alone, even though I've taken down that computer too, this setup alone took half an hour to tear down and organize. And whenever I do this stuff, I use the guest bedroom as like an organization because nobody's coming here this week. So I know that like just using this room for an extra space to just organize everything. But like, as you see, like, you know, we have headphones, we have the stream deck, we have the Rodecaster Pro with its cables underneath. So like, I will just organize everything. We got stands right there. We got a box of cables right here. When I really get into the grid of it, this is where like all the network stuff is gonna go. Lights, extra stuff will go over there. So teardown is going good. All right, 
here's where it gets messy. So this is currently my gaming computer and this is currently my stream slash creative computer. Now what makes the gaming computer special is it has a 2080 Ti in it. And what makes the stream PC special is it has a 3900X in it. So this has a really good CPU and that has a really good GPU. They both have 32 gigabytes of RAM. Uh, I will say in the creative machine, I have two 16 gigabyte RAM sticks. So I've thought about even doubling that so that way I can get 64 gigabytes of RAM. But basically what I need to do with these eventually or today is I need to combine these computers into one. Reason being, here in like the next month or so, I am going to be working with a computer company making like an insane gaming streaming machine. Something that could like do it all. So for the time being, I want to minimize both computers into one. Just having one good computer that for the time being, thus again, can do it all. Since I'll be waiting on this computer anyways, my primary focus obviously is editing videos, getting out just chatting streams, like getting product stuff done. So having a computer that can do all that is like the primary focus. And the goal this next month too, is to take everything that I don't need and, and sell it, get rid of it, like get it out of like the inventory for the year. So that way it's just less stuff, less clutter that I have to worry about. The only issue is I don't wanna have to completely tear apart both these computers. But also in return, I know that if I tear down both of these computers, that's like the best, most efficient way that I can just like clean out everything and, and just get like one ultimate computer going. And then annoyingly, I would have to also rebuild the other computer so that way I could sell it like locally, just like as a like, a, hey, gaming computer custom uh, PC for sale, like $1,500. Here it is. But I don't necessarily need to do that yet. So I don't know if I should just, for the time being, swap out the 2080 Ti into the computer or if I should just like, while well, it's all disconnected, like get it done now. <laughs> Fun stuff. On an additional note, we were not a fan of like the TV being over here. So we moved this whole area back to where it used to be, it's it's nice, it's, it's a little bit more cozy when it's set up like this. And then for the time being, I went ahead and threw this all out here to see if like, I would just like it out here. Cause essentially I do need like a secondary, like B-roll shot, some place that I can set up products out here and just kind of like get B-roll of like a mouse and keyboard maybe that I'm reviewing or like a monitor or something. Like a separate place that I can just have all this stuff to not have to continuously tear down my stuff every single week, just just once a month, right? Okay, so I'm actually getting a lot done today. Not gonna lie, a little stressful, but progressively getting a lot done. So one thing that's been eating at me was this closet. I wish I would have like taken more of a before, but uh, what I did was I actually have gone through and I've started organizing things. Um, uh, there's a lot of like space still left and a lot of stuff that we still have to do. That looks a little chaotic. I still gotta go through some of that stuff. I'm just like throwing it up there for the time being, but we're actually getting a shelf going for like things that I gotta sell. So like, for example, I still have to sell, a, you know, uh, an Haiti, I still have to sell a, a Razor Kraken. I got a stream light to sell and, and whatnot. So that shelf I'll compile things that I need to get rid of. With that, while I go through the computers, I wanted to go through all these computer boxes and make sure I'm just getting any parts, any manuals, stuff like that out of them before I start tossing some stuff. That is one of the hardest things to do when you're in this line of work is getting rid of boxes. As you see, like I hold on to boxes a lot. And that's typically for the most part, if I need to sell something, like at least I have the box for it for the customer. Like I just wanna be nice to whoever I'm selling something to. But considering the fact that whatever computer I sell, I'm just gonna sell like on Marketplace or to a friend as like, as is like built the way it is. Here's the specs. It'll be completely reformatted. This is what you get. There's no point in me holding on to the boxes of the parts that made these computers. Cause one computer I will be keeping, the other computer I will be selling. So getting rid of boxes to do, the closet was like, oh, 
always in the back of my mind for months of like, dude, this closet is so unorganized. I need to get stuff moved around. I need to get rid of boxes. I need to start getting a list of things to sell for closing out the 2021 20, year, which that sounds so weird today. Actually, everything today was very, very surreal because it feels like just a few weeks ago, maybe a couple months ago, I did all of this, but like if you go back into the vlogs literally a year ago when I moved to YouTube around this time, this is the last time that I've like done this. Did a like real deep clean through everything and got rid of stuff that I just flat out do not need. It is so crazy how fast time flies. But nonetheless, making huge progress today. I need to go to Best Buy and grab some things, uh, more RAM, some lights for the outside setup. Looking good though. Get, get out of here. Get out of here. Oh no, a spider just fell right in my drink. You cannot make the, like serious, fell right in there. What? <sighs> Little protein, never hurt anybody. Well, hello, chauffeur. What? You're my chauffeur. I will drop you back <laughs> off where I found you. <laughs> 